a Choo Choo Charles plush available to buy now. Da -da 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 -da. One Choo Choo Charles plush, please. Ah! So those are no longer for sale. I'm gonna make my own Choo Choo Charles plush. To make a plush, you need fabric, buttons, and stuffing. I'll run out to the shops and get it now. Here's some red, white, and black fabric, and some stuffing. Also, buttons. How do you stick this together? Do you use glue? Magnets? Magic? Oh, right, you sew it. Oh, I didn't get needles. Or thread. Here's a needle pack. Nice. I'll start with the base of the train. Basically, I need to make the back cab and the lower rectangle part first. I cut out strips of fabric using scissors. Wait, where are my scissors? Oh. I'm cutting the fabric into the right shapes and sewed them together to make the first parts, stuffing it as full as possible. This gives us this base to work off of. It's very, um, rectangular. Next, we'll need the engine. Since this is a cylinder, it's pretty easy to make. It's just one sew line across the middle and then another one to stick the face on. I sewed on two buttons to make the eyes and used a red marker to draw on teeth. There are pipes along the corners of the cab here. I'll make those by sticking in these red Chanel sticks. I call them pipe cleaners, but thinking about it, that's weird. He should also have this little chimney on top of him. I'll make that by rolling up some fabric stuffing it and sewing it on top. Next up, I added wheels. Charles has 10 wheels total, I think. I can't count. So I sewed on 10 buttons for wheels. 1, 2, 4, 3, 5, 6, 8, 7, 9, 10. His two bumpers at the front will be made from some more buttons. And I used a white button at the front to make a light. I then put a big glob of glow-in-the-dark glue on top so that it glows at night. It doesn't glow very much though. He also has a ladder on the sides, which I made out of... Okay, I'm going back to the shops. I found these wooden ladder pieces, which I cut down to size and glued to the sides of the cab. Okay, the glue is making the fabric turn a weird white color. Uh, we are going to ignore that. For his legs, I will need precision and skill to make these right. So instead of doing it myself, I took this Timothy plush I'm gonna use in an upcoming Roblox Doors video, and I'm gonna chop off his legs. I'm sorry, little one. No! I won't do it. I will painstakingly cut out and sew eight legs. This took me six hours. I stopped filming because because my camera ran out of space. I got a new camera and attached the legs to the body, finishing him off. There! Oh no, the bumper fell off. Pretend it's still there. Now it's time to compare mine to the real deal. I asked my Discord server and they decided mine was better. No, ignore what it says there. Trust me, they actually think mine is better. They just all misclick the button to vote for the real one. Okay, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Thanks to all my members here. Become a member to support the channel and give me money.